For today's recipe, we're gonna put our big green egg to work, helping us make some amazing shredded chicken. So first things first, let's get out, get that big green egg started, and then let's get our prep done. We went ahead and stirred the charcoal, got that ash out. Now it is time to refresh with some of that beautiful Fogo charcoal. Well, as you can see, I've got the egg igniter working for me. I'm gonna go ahead and start that fire right in the middle. Get a good little ember pile built, right? Just get a good little base of fire going. And then I'm gonna go from flame to fan and really get this thing kicking into high speed. Okay, we just hit 200 degrees, so we'll go ahead and add the convector in, and we're using the uh, expander basket as well. Now you can see I already have the drip tray in there, and I already put the grill grate on. Saves me a ton of time. Now that we've got the convector in, we're gonna go ahead and get our Egg Genius plugged in, so we'll plug in the power, plug in that pit temperature, we'll go ahead and get that hooked up. Next, we will go ahead and get the top adjusted, get this all fired up and adjusted to our cooking temp today. Now that we've got the Egg Genius all fired up, we're gonna go ahead and set our pit temperature today for 350 degrees. We'll hit update. We'll let that take place. And now look at that, fans kicking in at 100%. It's gonna start driving our pit temperature up right at 350. For the ingredients today, uh, very easy once again, because it doesn't take a lot to make amazing chicken. So we're gonna employ the big green egg, egg genius today. That's really gonna help us control this and not have to fuss. We'll plug it in, hook it up, we'll know when it's done. Uh, we're gonna use a little bit of that canola oil that we like, some of our cluck rubs. So we're gonna do a little balsamic chicken rub, and then we've got a three pound chicken right here that we're gonna slow roast, pull, and make some amazing pulled chicken. We've got the chicken upside down. You can see we've already tucked one wing and I'm basically just gonna go through here and tuck that wing as well. Now, we're gonna grab our oil. We're gonna give this a light coat of oil on the backside like that, right? And then we're gonna get in here and season it with the cluck. And you know what we always say, season as light or as heavy as you want. That is what this is all about, right? Creating your own recipe. Now, we'll go ahead and flip this guy over and we're gonna repeat that process right here on the top side. So we'll get that all seasoned up, get that oiled up, I should say. And then we'll go ahead and get that seasoning put on there as well. Now we'll go ahead and let this sit while we get the egg genius hooked up and uh, get that egg right up at that 350 degree mark where we uh, are gonna be cooking today. We just hit 350 degrees, time to load that probe in the thickest part of the breast. Now we'll go into the Big Green Egg app and we're gonna go ahead and set our temperature alert 165 degrees. Let's give our big green egg a burp and take a look. There we are sitting right at 105 degrees. Beautiful and smells absolutely delicious. So we'll go ahead and close the dome. Keep cooking until we hit that 165. Right there, we just hit that 165 degrees. Look at those juices running out. We'll go ahead now and get this onto our sheet pan and then we'll take that in the kitchen, get ready to shred. Well, first thing I like to do is go through and take any of that skin off and then I'll start removing that breast meat and then just go through here and basically shred that breast meat up like that. And then what I'll do, I'll go ahead and do the same thing on the legs and the thighs. And then don't forget also to get in there and get that chicken tenderloin out as well. But that's pretty tasty, right? Some amazing, beautiful shredded chicken for sure. Well, there you have it, low effort, high reward, and tons of flavor making pulled chicken on the Big Green Egg. Now, if you're looking for another easy recipe that has a ton of flavor, check out our beer can chicken video. That is coming up next.